And so cervical cancer screening has been along for a long time, and it actually has been the, one of the most effective screening tools that we have for women to prevent a cancer. Um, it's reduced the incidence and the mortality or death rate of, of cervical cancer. It should be started at age 21, and we actually have a slide for our viewers to follow along as I um, kind of lay out the guidelines. But age 21 is when we should start our screening test for cervical cancer, and that just includes a pap test. Um, and it can be done if a normal result is um, uh, resulted then every three years in general. For our older women though, starting at age 30, it can be combined with an HPV test. And if negative for both of them, it can be spaced out up to five years, um, which does allow a little bit more um, increased sensitivity and specificity, but also to keep going to your annual exam um, to address other issues. But in terms of the cervical cancer screening, it can be spaced out if both tests are negative.